Hello everybody. How are you all doing today? I hope you are all doing good from wherever you are watching this video from. I am doing great from my end and I really welcome each and every one of you to our YouTube channel. If you are new here kindly, remember to subscribe to this channel and also turn on the notification bell so that every time we have a new video, you will be able to get notified. And for the returning subscribers, I want to say I'm so grateful for each and every one of you. You have shown the support and thank you so much. Now, talking of friendship, I know I talked of Nacho's friendship with Harry and Meghan. And that was actually recently because I remember the post that Nacho had and it was talking a lot of sense. He shared a very powerful message and it's actually a motivating one and I hope that you all got to watch that. I hope you got to see what Nacho posted and the power of making some choices. So that is actually life choices. That is what Harry and Meghan did. And Nacho was talking of the same. It's not that Nacho speaks out of nowhere, but I have seen he is talking of some things that we relate to, especially for those of us who have always been here following up on the lives of Harry and Meghan. You can really see the sense of Nacho's posts because of the life Harry and Meghan are always living in. So I just felt like, you know, why not appreciate Nacho in a very special way? That's why I am here just for an appreciation and reflecting on a lot of things that he has done with Harry and Meghan. I just felt like, you know, it's not all about that single post. There is more behind it. And that's why I just came here to share with you most of the highlighted parts because I won't finish mentioning the positive things that Nacho has done for Harry and Meghan. They have been there for the longest time. And Nacho has been a real brother to Harry and Meghan. And I like the fact that Nacho is never swayed by the crowd because there are a lot of haters outside there who actually might tend to influence you on hating someone basically for no good reason. But learning from Nacho that you can really have a friend and no one should make you feel like I'm loving someone who is actually, you know, let me say a failing person who is attacked by everyone. At some point, we have such kind of people who really leave you as a friend just because he or she see that everybody is against this person. Why am I still here? So that is not the case with Nacho. That's why I am celebrating him in a very special way. So allow me share with you a small clip of him. This was actually... I don't know when was this exact video made, but I just liked the message in it. So listen to Nacho, first of all, and then I'll comment something thereafter. I've been friends with him for 12, 13 years now, and I've seen it all happen, right? From the very beginning, when he was who he was, and he was younger, and that was all great, and he's a wonderful man, some, someone that really cares, he's really committed, he really cares. He cares yeah. about children, he cares about making the world a better place. Then he found Megan, who is an incredible girl. You met her, she's amazing. She gave up all of the things that she had to marry this man that she loves, which is great. And people think of it like, oh, how easy it is to, you know, for you, girl, to go marry this guy. But nobody knows all the very hard things that go with that. Yeah. Uh, to me, the most surprising thing is that media and even some people are not seeing that these are heroes. We, we should be treating them as heroes. These guys are taking their time to make the world a better place. And they're all fighting in our, you know, for us. And right. instead of us embracing them and loving them and, and cheering them up, we are attacking them. Yeah. So it's a shame. I, I hope you have heard that. You have heard that. Nacho speaking of, you know, these guys are working towards making the world a better place. And Nacho really agreed to that. I have seen people do not believe in Harry and Meghan and the work they are doing. A lot of hate has always been driven out of that love that they have for each other. And people talking of they are just looking for money in every single way. But I'm like, you know, 
away from looking for money because that is also what they need to do. They do not get any funds from the royal family. So they also need to be supporting themselves in making money for the sake of their family. So away from that, we have seen them working for some things that they do not even benefit from them, but the society do. And I agree with Nacho talking of Harry and Meghan are working towards making the world a better place. And I have always mentioned that Invictus Games is one of the things that we need to look into whenever we mention the success. We also need to look at the work that they have done with the actual foundation, among others. So Nacho agreed with that and I really support that point very much. I love that. You have heard that and I do not know why people should hate on someone who do not even come to your home and attack you directly. You know, I just feel like the media have always been attacking Harry and Meghan directly. If they actually get a chance to go to their home, they will even go there and just talk some nonsense directly to Harry and Meghan. That is the media and you, you will never change the fact that Harry and Meghan are loved. They have tried by all means to make people feel like, you know, we should not be supporting them, but we need to attack them too. But they will never win because at the end of the day, the work that Harry and Meghan are doing is something that outshines everything. So anyway, in today's video, I really felt like we need to be respecting such kind of friends and I respect Nacho each and every time I hear him speak. He is such a great brother for Harry. And I remember the message that he also shared recently about, you know, the muddy water is best cleared by leaving it alone. And that is also relating to the other post that I shared with you recently about the power of stepping away. So Nacho is always speaking sense. I just like everything that he speaks about life not only harry and megan it actually encourage most of us in life and how we tackle things so just because nacho is always here to motivate us let us take that chance and learn from what he does yeah that is it this was all about appreciation of nacho and the work that he has done especially for the successes and I also have something that I liked about Nacho's post that he posted Harry and Meghan together and he was like, did I tell you I love your jam? So, you know, Nacho received the gift from American Riviera Orchard. And I also like that it's an appreciation, you know, people will attack you, but let us appreciate such kind of things. Honestly, it will cost you nothing. So you have seen, Nacho will always win because of the heart that he has. Let us learn from him. So many thanks to you, Nacho. And I came here to appreciate you in a very special way together with my online family. And I wanted to say thank you so much for showing us the ways and how we need to tackle things in this life. So I don't know what you have to say about this kind of story. Leave a comment down below concerning the same and allow me end it here. Thank you for watching up to this point. Remember to subscribe, like, and share. Until next time, goodbye.